Hey, hey, why are you looking so sullen? Mm. Why? Do you have a problem? Yes. What is your problem? Tell me, tell me. I don't know what is plus N. Plus N? What yeah. is that? Assalamualaikum and hi everyone. So you guys have heard the conversation between person A and person B and it seems like person A does not know what is blast N exactly. Henceforth, I'm going to briefly explain what is blast and blast ends, and I'm going to show you how to use blast N and how to interpret its result. So first, what is BLAS? BLAS finds regions of similarity between biological sequences. The program compares nucleotide or protein sequences to sequence databases and calculates the statistical significance. What about blast N? The N at the back at the blast word denotes the nucleotide, so that is why it is called blast N. The blast N program search nucleotide databases using a nucleotide query. So, any query? Okay, on to the tutorial. First, Google up NCBI, which stands for National Center for Biotechnology Information, and click the home address. So here we're gonna see there are four types of blasts, which consisting of blast P, blast X, B blast N, and lastly blast N. The latter is the one we are going to have tutorial on. Hit the blast N section and in the query box, paste the provided sequence into it. Make sure the sequence is in nucleotide sequence, not in FASTA format, else it could be run. FASTA format is specific for blast P. To specify the result, you can select any options on database. If you want to specify based on organism, simply choose desired organism in entry box. When every criterion has been selected, hit the run button. Results usually comes off of a moment. However, if you have registered on NCBI, the results can be obtained in shorter time. Otherwise, you will have to wait. The result shows here is a summary that displays the length of your sequence, the database name, and other descriptions. And by clicking on the thin red line, the name of the species, score value, and e-value are presented. Score is a number used to assess the biological relevance of a finding. In the context of sequence alignments, a score is a numerical value that describes the overall quality of an alignment. Higher numbers correspond to higher similarity. While the expert value is a parameter that describes the number of hits one can expect to see by chance when searching a database of a particular size, the lower the e-value, or the closer it is to zero, the more significant the match is. However, keep in mind that virtually identical shots alignments have relatively high e-values. Plus, here you can see the top segment displaying the color key and the query best scale. The colored bars represent the actual hash SPS. High scoring segment pair HSP is the fundamental unit of BLAST algorithm output. The position of each bar indicates the region of the query the HSP covers, and the thin line indicates that the two HSP are from the same sequence. Proceeding to the descriptions, max score is the highest alignment score between the query sequence and the database sequence segment. Next to its column is the total score that denotes the sum of the alignment scores of all segments from the same database sequence that match the query sequence. Query coverage is the percent of the query length that is included in the aligned segments. This coverage is calculated over all segments, while the E value is the number of alignments expected by chance with a particular score or better. The expect value is the default sorting metric and normally gives the same sorting order as max score. Iden is the fraction of query sequence that aligns to the subject sequence, and the most right column is the accession number that serves as an identity number for a sequence. Next, click on the organism where it displays the title, accession number, and the length of the matching region for the subject sequence. Here it shows 99% PF query sequence are conserved with subject sequences. Afterwards, by hitting on the accession number, description of the organism and the related literature reviews are shown. For a further and in-depth studies on the organism, simply click on the publication. That is all. Hey, person A! Hey, person B! So, 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 so! Have you understood what is glass N and how to use it? Um, so, so. Guys, don't worry. If you don't understand, you may ask your lecturer. And that is the solution. Don't give up! Keep it up! And thanks, thanks for, for watching! watching.